Welcome to digitalconstructive.com and in this video we're taking a quick look at a few C21 building moving and demolition exam questions. If wind speed is so great that the structure being moved swerves from side to side, what action should the contractor take? The correct answer is D. Postpone the move until it is less windy. A two-story building that has 2,000 square feet of floor space per story is being demolished and generating 40 pounds of debris per square foot of floor space. How many tons of debris will this project generate? Exclude the roof. The correct answer is C, 80 tons. When using a cutoff saw to cut steel beams, which of the following should be worn? The correct answer is A, gloves and a face shield. Now these are just a few of the thousands of possible questions that could appear on the C21 license exam. Obviously there's going to be a lot of information reference, evaluating plans and specifications, determining job methods and equipment needed, uh, evaluating job site readiness, estimating projects, mobilizing labor, equipment materials, moving preparation, separating demolished materials, and then of course safety is going to be a huge part of this exam. Remember there's thousands of possible questions that could appear Many of them are going to be math related and they're going to be covering varying aspects of the demolition trade. 24% of the exam covers planning and estimating, 20% covers project preparation, 5% covers building moving, 34% covers structure demolition, and 17% covers safety. What we've done is we've taken all of the information you're going to need to know, we've condensed it into summarized cliff note formats with the most specific information on the C21 exam, clearly written out with examples, descriptions, everything from the most basic uh, aspects of the demolition trade all the way to the most advanced concepts. The course would come in either physical study guides or we have eBooks. You'd get online practice tests, online lectures, mathematics courses to make sure that your mathematics is tight and you're prepared for those quick math questions and then of course all our programs come with an application preparation tutorial and review to ensure your application is filled out correctly before you send it off to the CSLB. Now we've got two other videos that you'll see appear shortly or you can check out below in the descriptions. The first one goes a lot deeper into the exam, the process, where you take the test, everything you need to know about the law side of the exam the math sections. I definitely guarantee that you'll find that video helpful and I recommend that you watch it. The other one goes into the requirements for the C21 exam, how to fill out the work certification correctly, uh, criminal record, the process, how long it takes to submit an application and how long it takes for the CSLB to process it. Everything that you need to know for the administrative level as well as all the different things you can actually do with a C21 license. You're definitely going to want to check out those two videos and our C21 crash course you can find in the links below. I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions, feel free to drop them in the comments. Like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks again for watching, and this is digitalconstructive.com.